Hello all, welcome to this session. In this session, I am going to explain and practically demonstrate how to retrieve browser name and browser version using Selenium. So let's get started. So I'll quickly switch to this Eclipse ID where we have this Selenium demo project. Okay, it's a sample Java project guys, which is already configured with WebDriver Manager and Selenium libraries here. If you go to the pom.xml file of this project, you can see, you can see that it is already configured with this WebDriver Manager and Selenium libraries. Okay. Now what I'm going to do is I'm going to write the code here. Okay. So using the Selenium code, I am going to retrieve the name of the browser that this particular automation script is using. And also at the same time, I'll retrieve the browser version. Okay. Whatever the browser in which the automation script is running, that browser version I am going to retrieve. So how to do that? I'll write the basic one: web driver manager dot chrome driver dot setup. Okay. Then I'll write web driver driver is equal to new chrome driver. Now hover the mouse on this web driver and import this web driver interface from Selenium library and chrome driver class from Selenium library. Now I'll simply quit the browser. Okay. So before I open the, uh, like before I quit the browser, okay. After opening the browser and before quitting the browser in between, I'll write some code here. Okay. I'll write some code here to retrieve the browser name and browser version that this particular automation script is utilizing. Okay. So what I have to do for that, I have to type cache this driver case. Okay. I have to type cache this driver. How to type cache the driver? I have to write a driver here. And type cache this driver with remote web driver. Okay, otherwise it's not going to work. Guys. You have to type cache the driver and put the circular brackets here and say dot. Now hover the mouse on remote web driver and import this remote web driver from Selenium library. Now again, say dot, you will get some methods. Get capabilities method you have to access. This get capabilities method will return the capabilities class. So here I'll say capabilities cap is equal to okay like that you can write for the mouse on this capabilities and so there is a spelling mistake we have to change it to capabilities T I E S. okay here i is missing okay other than that everything is fine import this capabilities from selenium now using this object reference we can retrieve the browser name and browser version how to do that system.out.pdln cap dot get browser name this will retrieve the name of the browser and this print statement will print it in the output console system.out.println cap dot get browser version okay so whatever the browser that is chrome browser it is using so chrome browser will be printed in the output at same time what is the version of the browser that is being used in the automation script that browser also version also will be printed in the output after that browser will quit and we'll see the output in the output console Let's run this code. I've already run the code. In a while, the browser will launch and it will quit. And meanwhile, you will also see that this is a Chrome browser, guys. You see, Chrome browser has been launched, and this is a version of the Chrome browser that is just now launched and quit in this particular automation script. This is how, guys, we can retrieve the uh, browser name and browser version. Okay. So, what may be the re what may be the use of retrieving the browser name and browser version? So guys, if you are using some reports like extend reports and you want to mention some system or environment details into the extend report, when managers or some other uh, higher level people want to look into the report, they want to see like where exactly the scripts got executed, in which browser they got executed, okay? And in which browser version they got executed. I, I don't want to hard code this browser name and browser version in that uh, extend report. Rather, I want to get the things dynamically from the automation script. To do that, we have to use, we have to write this kind of code case. Okay. We have to write this kind of code to get the browser name automatically instead of hard coding. Here I can hard code as Chrome. Here I can hard code as a version. Okay. But tomorrow, if the browser version changes, I have to again modify the hard coded browser version here and provide the latest version. That is a headache process. That is maintenance problem. So instead of that, whenever you are running the scripts, if you dynamically get the browser name and browser version, and you can um, uh, attach this uh, information, add this information into the extent reports or any other type of reports that will be better than hard coding them 
in the automation scripts. Okay. This is the purpose of retrieving the browser name and browser version, guys. And this is the process of retrieving the browser name and browser version. Okay. So hope guys, you understood uh, how to retrieve the browser name and browser version using Selenium. And also you have understood the purpose of retrieving this browser name and browser version using Selenium. Okay. So that's all for this session. Thank you. Bye.